It is not a move directed by the Chief Medical Officer of Health. The school reentry plan has always included a vision of taking a regional approach to shift specific school boards when needed. We've created clear criteria to allow school boards to request temporary shifts based on four areas. One, the board would need to demonstrate a chronic substitute teacher shortage. Two, a significant number of students and staff would be in quarantine or isolation. Three, we would assess if there were recent requests from the board for short-term shifts for a number of their schools, and four, the level of COVID-19 cases in their region. While the preference is to learn in school, we recognize some school boards are dealing with operational pressures due to rising COVID-19 cases within their community. I am responding to the board's requests and respecting their local autonomy. By having a clear process in place, we are giving them flexibility to move to at-home learning when necessary. Every board situation is unique, and we will assess requests we received based on those four criteria. This move to a regional approach recognizes that COVID is not affecting schools in the same way across the province. In fact, 81% of schools currently do not have any related cases. We've always stressed there is a need to stay flexible and nimble during this school year to deal with the challenges of this pandemic. When we were developing the reentry plan, we worked with education partners, with Dr. Hinshaw and her team. Uh, we uh, shared that information. We continue to work with all school authorities. Uh, we've had a very successful year thus far. We're less than 40 days from the end of school, and we have been able to maintain the vast majority of students uh, in class with a teacher in front of them. And as I said earlier, uh, right now we have less than 1%. I believe it's 0.35% of students and staff presently uh, who are uh, COVID active. And uh, we have 81% of schools across the province who do not have a related COVID case at this point in time.